right, it's his first thoughts, and Microsoft Flight, first time I've loaded it up, and um, noticing there's going to be signing into against Windows Live, I can't because I have got my account name, no use it, use Steam, which is interesting because this is on Steam, so why don't they use against Windows? Anyway, uh, let's give this play up soon. Place is not the best button for it. Right, I'm going to be trying first with the keyboard and then with a Xbox controller. Because Windows works more with Xbox controllers and it's undeniably the best shot for Windows. Unfortunately, it seems to be PC game, but we'll try with both. Because some people prefer to use controller, some people prefer to use keyboard. I'm not sure which one prefer from the controller. As you notice, it takes a while to load. Come on. Peter is on that slow. It's about a 500 gigabyte, um, 4 gigs of RAM, 6 core processor, going to 2.8 gigahertz, and not the best graphics card, only a uh, 5670 Radeon HD. It's not exactly anything to boast about, but neither something to complain about either because it plays every game. It's usually about 30 FPS, which is fine for this. Fraps obviously decided it doesn't want to go 30 FPS for this, but it should be playable. If it starts to load up. But what use Fraps and excuse for it is actually really slow. Let's turn the settings down. This is for. Yeah, we'll just skip the introduction. Seems to be. Are you ready to fly? Bit buggy. Doesn't look too good. Move the controller right and left to turn, Sorry, or forward and back to climb and descend. They're saying that. It's good. Horribly, um... You see those hot air balloons ahead of us? Let's weave our way around them. Try not to hit them, though. You might have to turn a little harder to get around the next balloon. Not We're getting a little too low. Keep the nose up. You're getting the hang of it. I'm not. I really am not getting the hang of it. Hate the tutorials, they don't even get any idea. Whoa! It doesn't feel like just cause. One more. Let's see if I'm not even around the I don't see the balloon. Got oh, your stupid instruction, I'm sorry. Whoever let you in charge of an airplane. Glad I'm in it. I'm a pro at just cause. This next balloon is higher. We'll have to climb to it. Well first let's Go ahead get and throttle to it. up okay, the I see it, dude. One step at a time. Ah. Uh, up. Yeah, I know it's a balloon. She said so. More interested in where it is and what it's called. Stall, push, nose down. No. She said climb. I'm climbing, okay. Right. Let's be more or less stable now. No. Climb. RB. It's RB. It's got to be the Xbox one. Right. I can't, I can't use it. I don't know what the button is because you're not helping me much. If I'm using the keyboard, well, I should think I need to we'll know to get to the next balloon. See how our speed increases when we descend? Throttle back when descending. A bit As I said, my computer made me quite bad but she never made it that bad. Nicely done. Let's put your new skills to use and make your first landing. Oh god. Turn new right skills. and line up with doesn't the runway. Include, right, doesn't include landing, I'm sorry. Lower the landing gear as well. Press B to lower the landing gear. Throttle up to about 45% for our approach. Whoa, what have I done? I can't see. So I see you press buttons. Getting close. Throttle down to idle, lift the nose, and let the aircraft settle onto the ground. This is shit. I landed. <laughs> I just completely pressed the wrong button there. <laughs> Step one. Never press a button. Mission failed. It didn't crash. It didn't explode. It obviously worked. Okay guys, this time I'm going to use... You can guess what. We're going to use one of these because they obviously work a bit better. Are you ready to fly? Like that. 
Let's use our own controller. Move the controller right and left to turn, or forward and back to climb and descend. Oh, feels so much better. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to suggest to you guys use a controller. Good. Those air cost simulators you see those hot air balloons ahead of us? Let's weave our way around them. Try not to hit them, no, though. Know, some people just demo the free play nice. game without any gear, so get to be careful. I did that. I'll do it again if you want. I just did that one. Come on, let's do it. You didn't quite get around that one. Turn a little harder. I don't say, last one I did amazingly bad and you managed to say I did get around it. I went up. One more. Let's see if you can get around the this last tutorial balloon. is not actually helping me in any shape or form, other than to use the controller. It hasn't really taught me anything. This next balloon is higher. We'll have to climb to it. Yeah, how do you... Go ahead and throttle up to full. Have you told me that yet? Good. You may have done. Oh, I think you have. See how our speed decreases as we climb? Yeah. Even with full throttle? I have. Always throttle up to climb. Try not I to climb no. too steeply, or we'll slow down too much and stall. I am. Let's try that again. What do you mean, let's try that again? I was perfect. Yeah, you might be as confused as I am. It's a bit strange, isn't it? You ready to I'm perfectly ready to fly. fly. Yes, but dear, you seem to be as confused Move the as you seem right to survive. Right 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 or forward and back to climb and descend. Wrong. It's reverse psychology here, guys. Make sure we use reverse. Good. Good game, I suppose. Yeah, you see those hot air balloons ahead of us? Let's feels weave our way around them. Piece. Try not to hit them, though. Very I mean, nice. It's like having a little... It's not Whoa. too... That was close. close. That's the idea, isn't it? You're getting the hang of it. If I was a bomber airplane, you want to get as close as you can without exploding any air balloons. All right, one more. Shame it's not a combat simulator. It'll be amazing, isn't it? Great job. Oh, this it. next balloon is higher. We'll have to climb to it. Go ahead and throttle up to full. Doing it. So a nose dive thing, as you said. Good. See how our speed decreases as we climb, even with full throttle? Yeah, not really. Always throttle up to climb. Try not to climb too steeply, or we'll slow down too much and stall. Good job. We'll have to descend to get to the next balloon. See how our speed increases when we descend? Throttle back when descending. I'm amazing at this, seriously. I know it's... I'm gonna go and do a real web thing now. Nicely done. Let's put your new skills to use and make your first landing. Just a bit I don't get. Right you go from doing balloons to landing. I was like, yeah, thanks for that. Lower the landing gear as well. Okay. Pressing B. Throttle down to about 45% for our approach. Getting close. Yeah, I know. It's scaring me. Throttle down to idle, lift the nose, and let the aircraft settle onto the ground. Okay, I'll lower the landing gear. <clears throat> well, we've landed. Any landing you can walk away from is a good one. <laughs> You'll turn, I hope Great job on your first great flight. Great job on your first flight. I almost crashed the airplane. I have something fun lined up for our next lesson. It still hasn't stopped. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should turn the throttle off, I don't know. Amazing how much fuel I have left at the end of this. What we say? I think I did well. XP. It's an RGP game now. Well, that's my first thoughts. It's good, I suppose. It's good controls. Great with a controller, considering it's not really flight gear designed. Um, it's as you do it to listen to your instructor, unless she's lying to you and making you do the opposite of what she tells you to do. But it's a worthy sequel, really, considering how the last one was. It feels good. The only thing I would say is the graphics look shockingly bad, and maybe because I've just come back from playing Just Cause. But I thought if Just Cause can render entire space like that completely. Lovely and good. Why can't this one do it? No excuse about all your computers crap because I play mine at full. I play just cause two and full. So this one, 
I may be comparing it to a game that's nothing like it, but it has a flight. It feels like it, actually. It feels like Just Cause. That's probably why I compare it. Flying it with a controller feels a lot like it. Um, so, that's my first thought.